Amada was my younger sister, but she was one of my best friends. She was the youngest of our family, but she was one of the most important parts of our family. She was very smart. She was just everything you would ever want in either your child, your sibling. She just had some of the best qualities all fit into one. Her other friends, they had gone to a Halloween party and left at about 2 a.m. We all found out through blood tests and reports that they were completely sober, 100%. They were on a green light. The impaired driver was at 98 kilometers per hour and drove through a red light. The force was so bad that my sister had passed away on the spot because of the trauma that impacted her from the car. The girl sitting next to her flew out the back window. and She had passed away eight hours after. The third girl in the back seat uh, ended up getting into a coma with the immense brain damage. And then the two other girls, one was emotionally traumatized because she wasn't physically harmed, but she saw everything that happened. And then the uh, driver sustained uh, quite a bit of physical damage as well. So five girls were impacted because of one person's horrible decision. When we got to that hospital, the head nurse came and spoke to my mother and my, myself, and she first told me the outcome isn't good. So we walked into the resuscitation room, which was probably the longest walk of my life. And um, she was just lying there. And to think, not even four hours, five hours beforehand, um, she was perfectly fine. That moment will stay with me for the rest of my life. My mother could not even handle the fact that uh, she would have to plan a funeral for her daughter. So I, with an uh, amazing family friend of mine, went and planned it. And I remember thinking, this is the last time I'm gonna physically see her. I remember looking and trying to squeeze her hands and her feet and her like face and like just taking every detail. and making sure I remembered it. Remembering every, every detail of someone that you may not ever see ever again is the hardest thing. And no one should ever have to go through it. The loss that my parents suffer is so immense. When you lose uh, a very important part of your family, it's never gonna be the same. If I get married, it's not going to be necessarily the most happiest day of my life. I won't have my sister there. I don't have a younger sister anymore. I lost half my life, pretty much, and I'm scrambling at pieces just to get back the other half that I still have and hopefully uh, continue on in her memory. <laughs>